Hey guys, it's all about the colour today to brighten up our faces after winter. So today I'm going to do a really lovely orange lip and smoky gold eye look. From MAC I'm just using my Bare Study Paint Pot. It's really lovely. It's like the Estee Lauder Stone Place eyeshadow base that I always rave about. But this paint pot's got a slight shimmer to it which is really pretty and it just kind of comes through the eyeshadows but you've got to work in quickly. From MAC I'm using this eyeshadow Woodwinked. Big kind of like soft gold bronze colours are really going to complement the orange lip. I'm using my 224 blending brush from MAC just to really blend that. Over Woodwinked I'm using Honey Lust, another eyeshadow from MAC. Honey Lust is just a really pretty kind of glittery gold. You're literally just passing that over the top of the Woodwinked. From MAC I'm using my Dip Down Gel Eyeliner. I think this look is going to be a really good look if you're going on holiday and you basically want to look like you've made an effort but can't really be bothered. <laughs> I don't know if you like me, but basically when I go on holiday, I'd rather be spending my time having a sundowner than spending too much time getting ready. But then when the holiday photos come back, you think, oh yeah, I should have spent more time on my makeup after all. <laughs> Just going to put that dip down on my lower waterline and my upper waterline. Just have a little clear up. From Clinique, I'm using my under eye concealer number two medium. From MAC, I'm using bronze eyeshadow. And with the bronze, I'm just using my socket brush and just putting some in the corners. And I'm just going to blend that bronze into the corners with my blending brush and into the socket liner. And with the wood wink, I'm just going to go really tight to my lower water line. I'm going to come back to my eyes in a minute, but now I'm going to use my Rimmel London Wake Me Up Foundation Soft Beige. The foundation is lovely because it gives you good coverage, but it's not too heavy. It gives you a nice dewy effect too. I've had such a funny week this week. My boyfriend and my friends, we all went and took part in the Crystal Maze experience. <laughs> Some of you may be too young to remember the crystal maze. You end up doing all these different tasks and you have to collect crystals. You either get like, I think it's like skill, mystery, physical, another one, I can't remember which was. Basically my boyfriend's like, I think you should do physical. I was like, uh, is that because you don't think I'm intelligent enough to do <laughs> the mental ones? So we had our team leader, James, and he had to decide who was going to do the task at different times. I'm just using my Chanel Universe Bronzer just to warm me up as well. Anyway, I did the physical. I was the second one to go, so the first person who went actually I think it was actually my boyfriend, Rog. He didn't get a crystal. And it was really funny because then I did the first physical one. I've now got bruises on my knees. I had to like roll around in some tunnel thing. Rog said I look like a big old hamster <laughs> rolling about. The guy put my helmet on so it's like basically covering my eyes. Like I can't see a thing. But I won the crystal. But then there was a countdown. I was listening to everyone shouting through the window. Ran out of the room. He was like, yeah, you won the crystal, but you forgot to pick it up. <laughs> so I was like, fail. Epic fail. Anyway. Our team went from bad to worse. It was hilarious. So out of four teams, we were the only ones with no crystals. Everyone else had like about 16 crystals. How embarrassing. Take that bronzer down your chest as well. If we haven't got a tan at this time of year, we can just like pretend. Number seven, I'm just using my beautiful eyebrow sculpting pencil. I'm going to go really heavy on the brows. At this point, I'm going to add my Barbara Daily Glow Up Highlighter. Put some on my lip. I'm using my Estee Lauder Bronze Goddess Bronzer. From MAC I'm using my Melba blush. For this look you kind of want to keep to the kind of peachy orangey tones rather than going pink against the orange. Just before I do my lips I'm going to put my Marc Jacobs mascara. I often like to do mascara near the end of my look because then I think mascara makes such a difference. So you want it to be as fresh as possible before you go out. So for MAC I'm using my Water Blast Pro Longwear Lip Liner. These lip liners are great. You can go as heavy or light as you like. I'm going to go all over my lip and I saw it being described in one of the magazines as a Fanta lip. And I thought, oh my god, yeah, I love Fanta. Drinking Fanta always reminds me of being on holiday. From MAC, I'm using this really lovely orange lipstick, which is called Sides on Summer. You can really layer up the colour, or if you're not feeling that adventurous, just put the lipstick on without the lip liner. So I hope you've enjoyed my video, and if you have, please click like and subscribe to my channel, Carla Marie Makeup. We can check out all my other hair and makeup videos, and you can also follow me on Twitter, at Carla Bates, so I'll see you all soon.